Good morning, everyone. I am getting married, obviously. <laughs> I'm still just like in shock about being engaged. Anyway, I have a bunch of venues that I'm gonna be looking at this weekend. We're gonna start off today by going to one, not that far away actually, so that's good. Um, here in like a couple hours, so I'm gonna get ready for that. I'm gonna take you guys on all the venue tours with me and maybe you can help me decide. Probably not, cause I'm just gonna choose which one I like the most. So let's get ready. I am ready now and we're gonna go look at the first venue. This one is kind of like an outdoorsy cabin in the woods type of vibe. Oh, the lights back this there. This is how we did that free so pretty. DJ package. My parents are like, oh, we've been here. So like I said, this is the first venue and it was very like cabin vibes. I did like the outside of it, but anyways, I'm just gonna take you through the tour with me, voiceover vibes. So first we went into the bridal suite and it was like, all right, it was pretty cute. I mean, I had good lighting in there. Everyone had like plugins. I could definitely see it, me and my girls getting ready and there's just enough chairs for all of us. So it would obviously work out good. But here is what the outside looks like. I do like this little walkway path. Um, I don't know what these things are called, but like, I don't know, this path you walk down with the gravel. The gravel is kind of weird though. Oh, wait, I think it's mulch. The mulch is kind of weird though because the heels, I don't know about walking in that in heels, but this whole thing has like lights on it. So that would be really cute, obviously. And I was definitely envisioning myself walking this far from the bri bridal suite in my dress. And I was like, mm, yeah, this is a little bit of a walk to be honest. But I do like how the walkway was kind of hidden by all these evergreen trees. So when I'm approaching like the altar area, you wouldn't actually be able to see me because there's so many trees. So that is a plus. And I'm making a TikTok of this as well. Go follow me on TikTok because I'm posting a ton of wedding content on there. Um, but anyway, this is where the setup would be. I believe they have chairs included that would come out here. And then that is kind of like the little getting married area. So it was pretty cute. I liked that. And then walking back in, there's like this sitting area outside. There's a fire pit. So that's vibey. And I was like, okay, I, I could work with that. But I really wanted my whole like reception to be outside. Or if it was going to be inside for the inside to be super cute but here's the inside and that's the groom's room they get absolutely nothing just the bare minimum a tv tiny little closet basically just to change in and here is the reception area it's pretty dated i don't love it it's pretty bad lighting it's like orange in there and those doors don't open up to anything cute um there's a lot of decor included so that's a plus but i don't love it so that was venue number one um what i do like about them is that they have an all-inclusive package that's actually pretty freaking affordable but my review coming back this is what i told my parents the outside is so pretty the inside seems a little dated to me it's dark in there there's not very many windows and it doesn't really have like a view when you're inside i mean the ceremony will only be like an hour no probably like 30 minutes so i'm having a full wedding because i love outside and then like the wedding will be outside so that one is probably a pass um, the one I'm looking forward to the most is the last one that we're gonna be looking at, so we'll see about that one. On our way to look at the second venue, um, this is the one that I'm pretty sure that I'm going to go with, and it's down in Branson, so really pretty drive with all the trees and everything. It'd be awesome for people out of town to be able to stay in Branson, maybe go to the lake, stuff like that, and it's gorgeous, and it's my favorite, so hopefully I like it. Wow, look at that view. You. <gasps> with all the trees. Okay guys, I think this is definitely the venue. My dad is talking up a storm with the lady who showed us around. She's so sweet. And so I'm gonna give you guys a little bit of like a quick tour. Um, later, I'm gonna do a full venue tour. So I'm just gonna show you around a bit. So you come in the front door. This is the bridal suite, literally gorgeous. These you can't see in, but you can see out. So we could like change and stuff and it'd be fine. There's a cute little swing to take pictures. Um, this is where you walk in. If it were to be bad weather, we could get married in here and this would all already be set up. I'll show you guys the view from up here. Literally gorgeous. Then you go down the stairs. This is like where the main party would be happening. Food, there's the bar, and then here's outside. Boom, get married down there. 
Unfortunately, Abram couldn't come with me because he is working, but I just sent a video to my future mother-in-law, to my mom, talked about dates. There's two dates that we are looking at. One is on a Sunday and the music would have to be done by 9 p.m., so that's kind of an L. The other is on a Friday, and if we do the Friday, we could pay a little bit more and get access to here on Thursday to be able to set up and everything. But everything that I just showed you is like included in the price, and there's a closet of like decorations, so, we wouldn't really need to decorate, which means I could probably get married a little bit sooner because one of the dates is a little sooner than I was thinking, but it would be a Friday and still good weather out. So I kind of am leaning towards that. Um, the other thing is that my mom's already going to be in town in October for my stepdad's niece's wedding, which is why I can't have it on the Saturday that I want. Plus, this place isn't available. Kind of a whole thing, but anyway, I really love this video. I think this is definitely the video. We're just trying to figure out which date works best for us, get that contract signed, and um, yeah, everyone seems to love it so I just got a text let's see okay my future mother-in-law she said we love it yay she replied right away that's nice my mom's at a pickleball tournament and so I need to talk to my mom before I do anything crazy but I love it just imagine me and the wedding dress that I just got even though you guys don't know what it looks like it matches the venue vibes like perfectly oh and there's like fire pits down there so I'm really really liking this idea gorgeous here in Branson with the views and everything so also, at the beginning of this video, I was saying, oh, we're looking at four venues. After I booked this one, I canceled all the others because I knew I was going to say yes to this one. So this is it for venue shopping. This is just the venue. And um, right after this, I'm going to post a full venue tour so you guys can see all the details and get the details of where this venue is and all that, just in case you want to get married here or whatever. So um, stay tuned for that. But this is definitely it. I found a venue. I found a venue. All right, I'm going to film my venue tour for the other video. So, see you there.